What's going on friends? Welcome back to the channel. It's been a few weeks since I last did a video and it's because this quarantine has gotten to my head just a little bit. You know, I was really motivated at the beginning of this quarantine to try to stay productive and continue to kind of live as normal of a life as I can. But then I kind of got lazy and stopped putting makeup on and just stopped putting myself together. But today is going to change. We're gonna do something with this face. It is actually burning hot right now. I'm like on fire, literally. And I can't turn on the fan because um, it messes with the sound quality. So I'm just gonna be sweating here with you guys and doing my makeup. I'm gonna be doing a very red look today featuring the uh, Urban Decay Naked Cherry uh, palette. I only used it once at the beginning of this year and I really wanted to give this palette another chance to shine and I also have this Lancome what do they call this? Le Mono Chromatique <laughs> it's supposed to be a 3-in-1 eye, cheek, and lip product this is a powder but it's they call it a lip product too so let's see what we're gonna do as usual we're gonna start with concealer this is the elf hydrating camo concealer i am going through a little bit of a breakout situation around my cheek here and on my forehead much better as I was blending it and looking to the camera the white balance was thrown off and I was totally washed out for a second but this is what it normally looks like I'm gonna set everything with a Too Faced powder this is the Born This Way powder next we're gonna go into the Anastasia dip brow my brows have been kind of growing out a little bit but I do have some areas where the hairs just aren't coming out Next, we're moving into the eyeshadow with the Naked palette, the Naked Cherry palette. Look at all these beautiful colors. I'm really going to try to focus on the darker red ends right here. I also really like the brush that um, this palette comes with. So it's a dual-ended brush like this. Um, let's see, the first color I'm going to take, let's see, I'm going to take Juicy, which is this color right here. It's like a matte, uh, dark peaches color. I'm going to take the fluffy brush and put this color into the crease. Moving right into the next color right here. It's a shimmery color called Ambitious. Ambitious right here in the center. I'm gonna go back into that first uh, juicy color again, that matte peach right here to blend a little bit more into the crease. I'm just bringing it a little bit higher up. Taking another brush, we're gonna move on to the color Young Love, which is a shimmery pinkish red right here on my pointer finger. We're gonna go back into the dual ended brush that came with the palette and use the more tapered pencil brush side. I'm gonna go into the matte color called Devilish right here and we're gonna use that close to the lash line on the top and bottom. Next, I'm gonna take the ColourPop BFF liner. This is the color. Oh my god, it is wiped off. I will put the name of the color obviously on here. I'm going to line the top line. That eyeliner has kind of dried out a little bit, so it does get kind of flaky. All right, I am looking so washed out. I'm just gonna move straight into a little bit of bronzing to give myself back some color. This is the Afternoon Delight from ColourPop. Moving on to blush, I'm gonna take Max Prism. 
I'm also gonna take that Lan Chrome Le Chromatique Monochromatique. Um, it's actually a blush, a shimmery blush color, but um, I've tried using this product alone before. It is kind of patchy, which is why I always like to put a different blush underneath. And if you went a little crazy like I did, just blend, blend it out. Going in with the lashes, still sticking to this mascara. I need to get a new one soon, but why does it matter? We're still in quarantine. Gonna use this one up. Moving on to the lips, I have another product that I only featured once on this channel. It is the Sunny's Face Fluff Matte Lipstick. I love this color. I think it goes really well with the overall red look we got going on. It's a very strong pigmented color, so I like to dab. So something that I've always wanted to do is match the brows with the color on the rest of the face. Since we have a little bit of red going on, I'm gonna use a red eyeshadow. I'm gonna use this one here called Devilish, the one that we use near our lash line, um, and put it on the brows. See how it goes. Oh my god. At first I was kind of going um, light-handed because I was kind of scared, but wow, it's kind of crazy. Oh my gosh, I like it a lot. Man, this is something, I would totally wear this to like concerts and festivals. <sighs> I promise I will wear a look like this when we get to go back outside, okay? Oh my god, I really like this look, wow. Well, oh, and I think that is the finished look, you guys. I mean, it's not like anything crazy, but it's so different. And I'm kind of digging on. I'm digging on so much. I hope you guys like this too. I hope you guys enjoyed a little bit of time with me this week and during your quarantine. Stay safe out there as usual. Wash your hands, sneeze into your elbow. <laughs> Just stay home if you don't have to go outside. And yeah. Come hang out with me on my channel if you guys have nothing else to do, just subscribe. I will be sure to make more videos soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.